it was interesting discovering Nelsport and seeing what it looked like. Unfortunately, also the devastation that's happening there. And then also finding out that I've been wrong about Three Sisters all my life, thinking that it was a town. Meantime, it's just the Ultra City, the station, and the mountains. Here we are, we're on our way to Murraysburg. First again for me. First for me too. I've heard a lot about it um, recently when yes. we were in the Eastern Cape last. Yes, yes. Lots of people spoke about Murraysburg, so I look forward to seeing it. Yeah, Murraysburg is still in the Western Cape. Oh, but it isn't that the town? Yes, Murraysburg is in the Western Cape, but it's right by the border of the Western Cape, Northern Cape, and the Eastern Cape. Yes, they All kind of come together there. Around Murraysburg, yeah. Oh, so that's very interesting. Oh, cool stuff. Only 40 guys. Yes. Great. strong, eh? Yeah. Did you also read that in the Murraysburg area, because of all the provinces coming together and the different landscapes, there are seven different types of vegetation in the area. Serious? Including famous. Wow. It's quite interesting. distance is Murraysburg. Yeah, I see a steeple. Yep. Do you too? I see the steeple. <laughs> you can't miss it. Murraysburg. That's a nice church. Very nice. And look at the, the nice wide road. Yeah. Love it. Yeah. Ooh. Three steeples. Wow, Love the that's color pretty. And the windows. Yeah. Oh, it's beautiful. This is a pretty church, eh? I love the windows. Yeah. They look original still. Incredible. And the colour is gorgeous, yeah. eh? Very pretty. Do you think there's any way you can get in? I don't know. Is it locked? Yeah. There's That's a chain. Locked. There's a chain around it, yeah. Look at those windows. Here yeah, they're gothic windows. On the other side they weren't. Did you notice that? Serious? This is well, I don't know, maybe we should go back and check. I'm gonna go and check now. Yeah, but this it's beautiful. Is pretty, eh? Wow. Pointy. Yeah. Just want to see there from the main roadside. It's really pretty though, this church, eh? Yeah, I love it. It's the same. And from the main road, the other side? I 
love this front. Oh, they square in the front because of the shape of the towers, you see. Oh, okay. Rapunzel, Rapunzel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, here yeah. they not as pointy. Wow. But this is this is stunning. I love the front of this church. Yeah, me too. I love it. It's beautiful. Oh, oh wow, that? mommy. <laughs> Cute. Eh? There's a dog in the back. Cute. Very. It's a pretty house. Very much so. Quite a neat town, eh? Very really neat. Look at the canals with yeah. all the walkways across the canal. Oh, it's amazing. Wisteria. Did you have a? Did, can you go back a second? Yes. They were one of my mom's favourite flowers. The purple wisteria at the back. That hangs like that. It's so gorgeous. Oh, I see there. Yes. All over there. Wow, oh, that's pretty. She loved it. The lavender colour especially. Oh. Beautiful, eh? Stunning, eh? Fools me with nostalgia. Yeah. Oh. Very neat properties here. Also the lampposts in the middle of the street. Like Loxton, eh? Yeah. How's the pencil gate? How cute is that? <laughs> hey? Very cute. Perfect for a school. Yeah. Here's our type roof again. Yeah. This is very pretty. Love it. Ornaments. Yep. Shutters galore. People like their cats here. Ah, oh, it's I your kind love of town. It. It's <laughs> my kind of town. Oh, look at the police station. That's beautiful. It's sandstone. It must be some kind of sandstone. Blue church. Wow. I think this is the Methodist church. Just up the road from the Dutch Reformed Church. Yeah. How cute. Very cute. I'm just going to turn around. So it's I can locked up also. Yeah, they lock up. Uh, don't blame them, eh? For security purposes. Yeah, oh, absolutely. this is pretty. Very cute. 
so we just spoke to somebody and they told us that this is the Sunday school of the Dutch Reformed Church, that beautiful church at the back there. Snewberg Mountains. Yes, they might be under cloud cover. They might have snow on them because it's <laughs> chilly today. It is cold, eh? You can see how everyone is bundled up. Yep. How cute is that house? Hi. Right on the outskirts of I'm finished. Marysburg. Honestly, I'm ready to move in. <laughs> it needs a bit of work though, but it is, it's stunning, I love it. You always say you're practical. Mm. I don't know all these hills and mountains around you, if they're the Snilberg Mountains. Apparently they surround on the one side of Marysburg and then the Buffalo River on the other side. Yeah, I do think though that they must be the Snilberg Mountains. Now the Snewberg mountain range is a long range, it goes all the way down to Graaf Renet. Old town, eh? 1855. Yeah, very old. It was named after Andrew Murray, eh? Yeah. The, the when he was um, the minister at the Dutch Reformed Church in Graaf Renet. Graaf Renet, yeah. Because I know he was the minister at the Wellington that's Reformed Church as well. Also at some point, yeah. yeah. There's another cute building. This one? We yeah. Have it. This is the Magistrates building. Beautiful. It is stunning, eh? Gorgeous wow. wow. So well maintained. This I love to see. Yeah. Beautiful. Original stonework. Yeah. Really neat. Very nice. Look here, the bank shop. So this must have been a bank? Yep. Are the horses again? or might just be a small horsey. Oh. Hello. That's oh, a foal. Oh, Mommy. Coming to Mama. Oh. <laughs> wow, I love it. Almost as tall as Mom, though. Yeah. Look at that drinking, oh, eh? Or wanting to, at least. How are you drinking? Sweet, man. Cute. Do you think that could be Dad? Possibly. Or is that Aunt? I'm not expert, eh? Yep. No comment. Looks like on. Yeah. <laughs> Shush. <laughs> Just to prove that we are in Marysburg. If anyone had any doubt. Yep. I have enough doggies. Yeah, that's for sure. We are leaving Marysburg now and we are heading to the farm where we're staying for the evening. It's called Salem's Rest, eh? Yes. Okay, great stuff. 
and it's about 22 kilometers outside of Murraysburg. So here's our turn off. Swall cross. Yes, some gravel road. She says there's a little low water bridge that might have water in, but it um, very often has water in, so we shouldn't worry about that. Okay. Oh, that is. Oh, wait. This looks very deep. No, it's not. No, it ain't. Oh. <laughs> Scary. Yeah, no, it's fine. Luckily she warned us. Yeah, but what was scary, that's not even half the depth it was when we went through to Loxton that time. No, don't. Just let's not go there. <laughs> okay. Pretty horses. They are pretty, eh? Hey? Yeah. Inquisitive though, staring at us. Bye, horses. Our place? I think so. I think so. <laughs> <laughs> How are these crawls and look at these flowers? Yeah. And they're on the incline, eh? Hey? Yeah. Amazing. I wonder how old they are. Wow. So it's down here, hey? Uh, the arrow, yes, yes, I'd say. I would say so. I presume that's the farmhouse. Which one? That one there. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's a little big, eh? Hey? Yep. Oh, look at this. Is it this little one? I think this baby one is <laughs> ours. I like, I like. Yeah, it's freezing. Is the winter ever going to go away? Yeah. I honestly was expecting it to be a bit warmer. Look at this cute little place, eh? <laughs> wow. Cute, man. Very cute. Right on. No bright tonight. Wow, this wind is freezing. So let's go inside and see what it looks like. Oh, this is really cute, eh? Got a fireplace. Oh, this is really nice. I like it. Got a place to sit with the laptop and download the f videos that I've shot today. So nice. And the 
bathroom. Shower. <laughs> Corrugated roof. Danny. The basin. Our host brought us some sweet wine, eh? I think it might be Hanapurt or Muscadel, yes. Oh, I'm telling you, this is going to hit the spot, eh? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I've taken one sip and I it's can like, already feel the tummy warming the up. The tummy warming up. I'm telling you, it's freezing outside and this is really going to help. Cheers. Cheers. This is how we do it when there's load shedding. Coffee with a view like this. Good morning, <laughs> it is freezing, I'm sure it's just above freezing over here, um, apparently it was 10 degrees here yesterday, during the day, but let me turn the camera around and show you what the weather looks like now. Clear skies, what a beautiful morning, ice cold but it's stunning, and we had such a nice day here in our little cottage. In our little stone cottage. And we had such a cozy sleep with our hot blankets. <laughs> it was amazing. It was In stunning. between load shedding. But I must say, this place is beautiful. It's eh? gorgeous. But I suppose it's that time, eh? Bye, doggies. They have a wonderful life, yeah. Don't eh? they, just? <laughs> the farmer They're yesterday. Time to say goodbye. Yeah, the farmer. Can you yeah, get them? Yes, there they are. The farmer yesterday says that um, he's got three dogs. We saw the one yesterday and he says he doesn't know where the other two are. He hasn't seen them all day. Oh, my so he, nerves. <laughs> I won't make it. So you can just imagine how far they go roaming. Hey, his house is yeah, very close. Very close by. It's a wonderful stay. I really enjoyed it. Yeah, lovely place. Super cool. Love it. No, the road looks good. It does, eh? I'm just glad that weather's cleared up. These 
crawls are fascinating, eh? Incredible. Incredible. Wow. Never really stopped. I stopped once out at um, Williston, near by that Corbell house, to see what these look like, but this is incredible. Look at this. Stone works amazing. And look how they've sheltered them if they need to shelter the animals. They've got this wonderful shelter here. Look at this. Amazing. I love that shelter that they've made for the animals here. It's amazing. Me too. So I suppose I if they get extremely cold weather, yeah. then they and let protected. the and come inside there. Especially the baby angoras, apparently they're very susceptible to the cold. Look at that. It's just what a willow tree wow. does. It just creates this total sense of tranquility. Pretty scene. Yeah, it is a pretty scene, eh? After this beautiful picture you've just seen of that river, um, I went to go and look at a poster that was put up by the CSIR. And it's a public participation thing of theirs about uh, a solar farm that they want to develop in the area. That's so some kind of survey? Yeah, some kind of survey for people to participate in. Probably that, provide comment on yeah, that stuff, yeah. yeah. We've got a long gravel road of about 50 kilometers and then 25 of tar before we reach the N1. And with no rain last night, let's hope it's a good one. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs>